Hey, I'm Quentin from Notion Everything, and I'm going to give you a quick tour of this small business OS template for Notion. This one is specially made for small business owners, entrepreneurs, and solopreneurs, or even freelancers working with small teams. So let's begin with the navigation page of this template as it shows you what's inside and how it's structured. So the template is basically divided into four main parts for which we've created specific dashboards, company home, operations, business, and finances. And for each of these dashboards, we are using a few different databases that you can access here at the bottom of the page, or in Notion sidebar here, or by using these toggles on this useful navigation menu that you can find all throughout those dashboards pages. Now, let me show you what you can find inside those dashboards. And let's start with the operations dashboards as it's the one you'll be using the most. So inside of this operation dashboard, you'll find your projects, tasks, clients, and meetings. Starting with the view of your clients here on the left, then two tabs on the right, one showing your active projects, whether they are client projects or internal projects, and another one showing your uncompleted tasks. Finally, you'll see a section dedicated to your meetings at the bottom of the page. And one important thing to mention is that we've added databases templates in this small business OS. So whenever you click a client page or project page, you'll see a dedicated dashboard showing everything related to that specific client or project. Now, moving on to the business dashboard, which is where you'll be able to track all your relationships with your clients and leads, as well as your quotes and invoices. So let's say you want to track a new invoice that you've sent. You can add it from here. And when ready, you can add your details like a send date and maybe a payment delay and simply drag and drop this new invoice to the send section. What's cool is that you even get a reminder here so you never forget to follow up if needed. Then at the bottom of the page, you get a classic type view of uh, your sales pipeline where you can change the status of your leads and clients super easily. Next comes the finances dashboard, which is where you can create yearly financial reports to plan your budget and track your income and expenses. So if I open this 223 report here, I see that I can add my income and expenses for each month and see the total per month. And if I switch to the summary tab, this will give me the total amount for each quarter and for the entire year, which I then can report here for a better yearly overview. So this will give you a simple but very useful way to track your finances within your Notion system. And finally, let me show you the company home dashboard in part of this template, which hosts multiple very useful things, such as a full company uh, wiki to save and organize all your company knowledge, information, and resources, but also major information for your business, such as goals that you've defined for you or your team, a news feed if you have announcements to share with your collaborators, upcoming events you may have, and a view of your current clients and team members so everyone is in the know and knows what is going on in your company at the moment. So that's it for this quick tour of this small business OS. I hope it will give you a clear view of what you can find in this template, which obviously comes with a detailed starting guide, including videos and demos, so you never get lost. Thank you for watching, and let me know if you have any questions. Cheers.